Hey guys, we're back. We're going to do one more Grixis Delver um, here in Modern in the Tournament Practice TP room. We're up against Zing Yish. What up, Zing Yish? Um, and yeah, this seems like a, a good speculative, speculative, a good keep on the blind. Um, <laughs> we've got a couple of uh, fetches and some cheap cards in bolts to uh, get our angler out quickly and Colhan's Culligan's big K's command fucking lightning dragon's command to get it back if it gets a cap busted in its ass uh, thought Seize. Jesus Christ. Uh, he's going to take our angler, I imagine, but I guess, hey, that, that means our command does work, if that's what happens. He could take our command. He could just take a bolt. We shall see. He takes a bolt. Interesting. So he just played sorcery speed, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, prevent two damage <laughs> or prevent one damage. Yeah, basically. Um, let's get a blood crypt. Pass. Second angler is not the best. I mean, it's good backup in case the first one dies. But if the first one dies, we're a long way off from casting the second one. So there's that. Temple of Deceit. Okay, blue black. So either some kind of discard deck or control deck or melt despise. I despise that play. So you're gonna take my other bolt here, and then play a threat that I cannot deal with. Maybe is that the plan? It would seem weird to take one bolt and not the other. Right, okay, he takes one angler. Oh, right, right, right. He can't take bolt with that. He's got to take angler. Um, dur, dur. Helps to not be a giant dum dum. Um, no, here I want that one. No, and I'm going to just bolt him here in order to fuel the angler. He hasn't played any creatures yet. I mean, it's only turn two, but it makes. Um, you know, bolts seem like not the best here, so let's not pay to life and tap out for angler. Oh, maybe paying to life would have been better so I could buy back the other angler. That was a bit short sighted. So, deck has a lot of uh, play and a lot of taking da damage, and you have to be really okay with that. And I've said that before, but I'm not really playing that way. Master of the Feast. Okay. Interesting. Okay, beginning of your upkeep, each opponent draws a card. So, I think what I do here is just draw an extra card. Yeah, I'm not going to offer to trade with that. And then I can just terminate it. I mean, that's risky if he has counter magic here. 
But if not, I mean, I can still just bash back with Angler. Oh, he plays another one. Interesting. Okay. Er. Okay, what's up, Terminator? Dover. Okay, gonna probe for life here just to see what opponent has going on. And figure out if I want to trade for Angler or not. He's got another Master of the Feast. And a Notion Thief. Notion Thief, not a big deal. Thought Seize. Annoying. Um. Yeah, I don't really have another way to deal with that one unless I. Hmm. The plot thickens. Can I deal with the third master? You know, potentially not if he thought seizes me first. I'm gonna attack here. Could just be wrong, but. If he doesn't thought seize me now, I can. Cole hands command and get back my angler. Okay. Yep, I think it's likely a mistake from him. Now the question is, what do I do? I'm going to get back a guy and have him discard a card. This thing just seems great. I might put a second one in the deck. I'm always happy when I draw it. It's a lot of power. Okay, and that gets rid of his thought sees, which seems like the best way he had to deal with the angler, so not sad about that. Mana leak is a card. Okay. So I can attack into the master and bolt it. And then I have mana leak f or and then I can play angler and have mana leak for his notion thief. That seems good. Maybe a bit aggressive, but oh, I can't have Mana Leak up and play the Angler, so that was a little loose. Uh, I think I just play Angler here. Anyway. And I think I'm going to pay all the mana. In case I draw another Delve guy, I'll have one more in the yard. I could just, you know, discard my leak, but that seems like a one for one, which is okay. Notion Thief main phase seems a little weird. Okay, now I've double mana leak, which is really nice. And we're winning a race, so I feel like I'm in an okay position. Wrench mind. <sighs> well, I'm gonna leak it just so he has to 
tap all his mana. Okay. Vision schemes. Each player draws two cards. If an opponent would draw a card, I'd say you draw that card instead. So that's you draw four cards. No. Wow, what? You're gonna say I top decked you? No, I played smart. Um Okay, so bash in there. And play young pyro. Now if I electrolyze the notion thief, does he draw the card off of that? Or like it dies on resolution, is it still like I don't know how that works really. Master, okay. So I guess I see the combo here. Um Hmm, that was a terrible draw. If I attack with both, he blocks this and chumps here. And then I draw a card. Or he trades and trades and then we're at parity. Neither of that seems good. Maybe it does because it keeps him from being ahead. I think I'm going to go for this. Interesting. Jesus, man. Okay, a lot of threats. Threat heavy deck. Now he's on the pack rats plan. Of a lot of outs to just win. Um, gonna fetch first for marginal thinning purposes. Um, let's fetch basic island. Serum vision. Perfect. Uh, bottom, top. All right. Oh, the serum visions put the card in his hand. Oh, that sucks. I didn't even think of that. But it's still kind of worth it for this guy because now I'm just gonna draw bolt and kill him. Pyro sets me up to have lots of chumpers. Discards bolt. Interesting. Vision skins. It's a cute deck. It's it's clever. I feel like it might be more clever than than effective. Could be wrong. It's definitely good on the old budget front. Like, I, I'm not insulting my opponent. I quite like his deck. It's just decks like that that I'm drawn to aren't always the most competitive decks, even though they're, they're fun and interesting. See what happens here. Attacks with everybody. Okay. Uh, block here. Now I haven't seen one counter spell, but doesn't mean he's not playing them. 
Now, maybe this is too too aggressive. I should block that young pyro also. But I'm not quite sure how I die here. And I think I can just untap and bolt him and win. Plus getting rid of Notion Thief seems really good for me. If he's got a counter spell, I'm in trouble. He bolts me. Okay. That's fine. And? And you're dead. Okay. Thanks for bolting me. That's cool. Okay. What do we want to do from the board? Um, we want our opponent to concede match. Okay. Fine with me.